people welcome back to my channel so today i'm back with another braiding tutorial for you guys oh, like house. if you're new to my channel first of all thank you so much for watching this video if you don't know me my name is caddy and today i'm back with another braiding tutorial video um this is basically half braids and half cornrows going back um i decided to do not less at the back I decided to do not less at the back and then I did the cornrows at the front. I'm gonna show you guys how I achieved this. And this is basically waist, no, bum length because it's literally long, guys. And um, yeah, so if you guys wanna know how I achieved this hairstyle, make sure you keep watching. So yeah, we're just gonna get straight into this video. And um, I'll be using two and a half pre stretched expressions. I would also be using one edge control, a brush, a comb and a clip. Um, as you guys can see my hair is already washed and you know it's you know ready for me to braid and I'll go ahead and part my hair from ear to ear just literally a straight line. Guys right now I can't even see what I'm doing at the back. <laughs> Because I don't have a mirror at the back, so I'm literally just using my imagination and what I can see from the sides. Oh, but house. yeah, so if you want it to be very easy for you, try and get a mirror and put it behind you or get someone to help you if you know you're new at this. But yeah. Now I'm sectioning the hair so that I can start doing my braids at the back. Um, I've got a lot of tutorials on how to do knotless braids and um, I can't really show you guys the back, um, you know, what I'm doing. So if you guys want to check my other videos on how to do knotless braids or how to attach, you know, expression while you're braiding, I've got other videos on that. So if you want to check that out, you know, if you're a beginner and you don't know how to braid, maybe just check that out. Um, yeah, so I've literally finished the back. I just wanted to do not less because I wanted the braids to be really flat and oh, Yeah, house. I'm just not really a fan of box braids now, but I will be doing tutorials on box braids So as you guys can see I've already done the back now I'm gonna go ahead and do the front so I'm gonna use my edge control just to define the part in and Yeah, I'll start braiding now i'll just go ahead and start sectioning the hair i'm literally doing like medium braids um, as you guys can see my front hair is really not full it's really tidy guys so i normally start with my natural hair before i go ahead and start adding expression and this is because i like the front of my hair to be very natural and this is how i also do my client's hair um, so that when the hair gets old it's very easy for you to add you know edge control or gel you know make it look fresh again but if you start with um, expression sometimes it starts to lift very early oh, this is why when I braid or when I do cornrows I always start with natural hair um, yeah so normally if you're doing like a very long hairstyle um, you would need to put the braid in your mouth like I normally do just because it's so much easier for me so that I can braid it all the way down so yeah, and I'm just literally parting straight lines and I'm just going to keep braiding. For this section of the braids, I literally just, you know, part everything straight back, as you guys can see. So what I do is, because my hair at the front is really short, and obviously oh, um, I want the front to be, you know, very neat. So what I do is, once I part the first section, the tiny bit, I literally braid it like three four times before I go ahead and add um, the expression I would also do a video on that very soon just to show you guys what I'm talking about so guys as you guys can see I went off and I put the ends in hot water hot water just helps to seal the ends of the braids I also have a video of that you can check that out and I go ahead and add some mousse then I also go ahead and add um, olive oil spray just to add some shine oh, in the hair and yeah so literally this is the final look guys and I really love this hairstyle 
like I don't know if it's just because my head is very tiny and I've got a tiny face you know I feel like my hair braided back is so cute I really love it and um, you can still see my natural hair in the braids that's because yeah I think my hair was lighter than the expression but it's not bad I still like it <laughs> but yeah so this is literally waist length no bum length because it's really long so I really like it but yeah let me know what you guys think in the comment below um, don't forget to like this video don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in another video bye guys